Hey guys, Xeno Customs here. Uh, back with uh, Alcatel Idol 4. Uh, it's a really nice phone. Got the glass back, guys. Today, I got tempered glass with me today. As you can see, there's just a bunch of scratches. and I went and bought a tempered glass thing on eBay. Uh, it was, I think it was, it was $2.95 right here. Uh, also... Here's my Moto uh, E4 or G4. E4, sorry guys. Uh, awesome phone. I have to. Uh, I, ha I didn't do unboxing, but it's just a really great phone. Uh, I would think it was like eighty dollars. I love this phone. Uh, it's nothing but just awesome budget phone. Anyways, let's get into this. So let's. Um, oops, sorry. Um, let's open this up. How does this open? Something like this. Something like that. Not like that. Okay. Corners kind of just. Okay. Let's get this open. They give us dry wipe uh, wipes. You can use these. I prefer paper towel even or microfiber is the best. I just don't have it with me. So, step one. Well, first thing before we do anything, we should remove the plastic one. It'll just it's simply just try to get your nail underneath it. Try to get it. Just try to get it. Now just peel right off. So that come off. I'm just gonna throw that out right now. And as you can see, even with this, you can see it right there. There's like adhesive, so that's what you want kind of want to take off. So so you do the first one is wet to get all the adhesive uh things off. So I'm just, all it is is I think I believe it's I don't know, I think it's alcohol maybe. So wipe it all down. Okay. Take that. Now open your step two or number two. This is the dry one. Okay. Let's go like this. Can we get all the smears out? Because you don't want to mess up. I don't like this, so I'm gonna just grab paper towel. I mean, that's just better. It just cleans off a lot easier. And it looks it's a lot better. Okay, just make sure you have like nothing on there. Just clean it. No dust or anything like that, because otherwise you will see it in the. And like I said, guys, this phone just is uh. I've even used it for like a week or two and it's just really awesome. For I think it was like a hundred dollars. It was an awesome phone. So I definitely recommend this. Especially the speaker quality. It's really great. So just don't want to have any dust. So I did one screen before and I forgot to take off all the dust and it it was not great. Let's just say that. Okay. Surface is clean. See that? Like a mirror. Okay, take this. Pull that out. Okay. Uh, the part that has this peels off is the, the glue part, so don't touch it. So, take that off. What you want to do is the first thing I like to do is line up. Oh, there's already dust on there. Okay. Man, dust keeps on getting on this. Okay. Line it up with the holes. Kind of like that. And turn on the your phone. Just lines it up. Okay. Okay, so I sit like that and then you can grab your paper towel, just push all the bubbles out. Okay. Now it's on. There's a lot of bubbles in this one. That's really weird. I'm just squeezing out all the bubbles. Oh, 
Um, so far, I'm really actually not liking this screen protector because it's got like a lot of bubbles in it and the side is um, kind of a little weird. I'm not really liking this. So, um, and it's not a bad screen protector. It'll protect the phone. You can barely tell that there's some marks on there, but I can see them. A little bit maybe over time you can also grab like a blow dryer and if it's not sticking very well and just go right over it and it'll heat up and it'll kind of melt on there okay so kind of just get all this stuff on there all right let's put the case on move this background piece tree ish I just want to see how it's going to go um, with it, like, kind of around. Okay, get that. Slide that over. Um, let's clean it real quick. I have to say the screen, the screen protector uh, cleans off a lot easier than my other screen protector. But, I mean... Can see right there so I mean it's not let's see the sensitivity okay seems fine so I mean seems like it's all the keys work so it's not a bad screen protector Maybe it was just me, uh, I put it on wrong, but I put on my other escape, uh, screen protector on my other phones and it was fine. Like I put it on this one and I haven't had any problems with it, like no bubbles, nothing like that. So, um, I'm not sure this one doesn't have a rainbow effect, so I'm happy with that at least. So, hey yeah, guys, thank you for um, watching this video. Uh, also, the screen protector is, uh, like I said, it was cheap. Um, it's Magic Guard. Guards with the Z. Okay. So, it's not a bad. Um, for the price, at least, it's really good. So, thanks for watching, and see you all later.